hello friends welcome back to code tonight in today's video we will see how to create a task dealer in asp.net core so here we have asp.net core application and we will try to create a task dealer in this so for creating a task dealer we don't need any kind of third party library or another package uh, first of all what you have to do is you have to create a new class in the models or somewhere here so you can add a new class you can name it scheduler service so in the scheduler service you have to inherit it from i hosted service and i disposable these two are provided by the microsoft extension namespaces so these are available for creating task schedulers by dotnet core okay so you will get this code uh, along with the video so don't you worry about that and so here we have this run job method here which will be executed and here we are using a timer for scheduling the job after some time span okay so we have used here is a time span dot from minutes one so that actually means that this run job method will be executed every one minute okay so whenever you will run the application after every one minute it will execute run job method so you can change the time here to one hour or however you like so you can change the time here and this is the method which will be executed so here in this method uh, you can write your code whichever you want to execute uh, on uh, intervals okay so suppose you want to use some kind of repository or uh, you want to use some other kind of service then you can use this code over here you can use uh, the variable here dot service provider dot get service and here you can write your interface if you have and then you will be able to access your methods here okay so this is just to show you how you can use interfaces in this uh, job okay so because you cannot declare any interface directly here so for dependency injection you have to use those here so you have to place your code here whatever you want to execute and now we will see how it works so we have from minutes one so basically it will execute in every one minute we will just run the application so after adding this file what you have to do is you have to also go to startup.cs and here we have to add a services dot add hosted service and this is the class name that we have created here so these are the two things that you have to add and then you will be able to use task scheduler so i have run the application and you can see that it has reached here and if we continue the application okay it will now execute again after one minute so we will see if that executes after one minute so it is 3.23 now so we will see if it executes again in some time so guys this is scheduler will be running uh, automatically whenever you will run the application so you don't have to do anything specific for this So you can see that uh, the code has reached on debugger again. So basically it has got here after one minute as we have mentioned here. So this is how you can create task schedulers in ASP.NET Core. Now for getting the code what you can do is you can go to codetonight.com uh, we will mention a link along with the video. Here you can find the block task scheduler in ASP.NET Core and you can open that and you will be able to download the code from here on the download attachment button and you can copy the code from here also. You can comment on the video or article if you face any kind of issue and don't forget to share the video. Thanks for watching.